And this riff, bass riff is uh, inspired by Demand Lamius. It's just a basic blues bass riff. He said he might be retiring his channel, which uh, is a downfall because he said he's going moving into more TV stuff. And I understand why he's going into TV. Uh, it's for the money and just the markets where he can get more than what YouTube offers. He has 36,000 YouTube followers and he has like 7 million channel views, which is a great accomplishment. So this riff... Um, goes like this. So it's a basic blues bass line, which you can hear in like Jimi Hendrix and a lot of blues riffs. And it's going to be played on the A string, or the E string, 6th fret. Then you're going to go to the A string, 6th and 8th. To the D string, 6th and 8th. Then the G string, 6th fret. Then back to the 8th fret of the D and 6th fret of the D. Then to the 6th fret of the A. And then to the 4th fret of the A. And back to the 6th fret of the E string. And you're going to bend that note. Ready? Go. And I want to warn you, when you get to the 6th fret of the G string, you're going to let that note ring out, so it goes. And you can't do a vibrato. And what a vibrato is, if you're not familiar, you're going to, like, shake the string, like, like, let me get a close-up. I'll do it up close. And there is another way you can play this riff to spice it up a little bit. And you could go something like this. Ready? Go. Remember to rate, even if you hate, comment, and subscribe. And I just wanted to give a shout out to Demand Lambert and say, if it wasn't for you uh, making your bass videos as much as you have, I wouldn't be progressing and making as much bass lessons as, as I have. So with that being said, Demand Lambert, if you're going to continue making your bass lessons here and there, uh, someone like myself would really appreciate it because I've learned a lot from watching Demand Lambert. If you guys don't know who Demand Lambert is, uh, click in the links below or a link above my head and you guys can check out who he is. He's a fantastic YouTuber, probably the best bass player I actually have ever physically talked to and uh, chatted with, even in person or or uh, I should say big YouTubers, big bass players. He's just one of those dudes that is cool with everybody. So I love teaching bass and teaching what I have accomplished over the... Uh, years and that was just a simple riff that I thought you guys would like and you guys can be playing the finger walk like this where you take your thumb at the be every time you go down the string because some people are more comfortable playing with that kind of style. Let me see if I can get a, a better angle like this. And basically what I'm doing is I'm moving my thumb down every string when I'm playing, but I, I tip, typically don't do that. I typically like to just With that being said, I will definitely see you guys in the next video. That's just a basic blues baser for beginners who actually love to play bass 
and just wanted to get a cool groove. And it's just a basic scale that I uh, said you could probably find in like Jimi Hendrix and old blues music like B.B. King. They pull out stuff like that. And you can play it on any string. You can just... So, with that being said, have a nice day. Peace.